brother, the Reverend Mr. Jesse Jackson, who uh, is a candidate for the presidency of the United States. Bishop J.O. Patterson, presiding bishop and chief apostle of the Church of God in Christ worldwide, Sister Deborah, Bishop L.H. Ford, first assistant presiding bishop, my personal friend from Chicago, Bishop J. Blake, senior second assistant presiding bishop, to distinguished members of the general board, a special sense to friends who have prayed with me across the years, Bishop Jones and Willis and Walker and Sherman, others of you, I'm just so grateful to have this chance to share with you today. To the board of bishops, to the national officers and Mother Madam McLaughlin, to the pastors and elders, supervisors and missionaries, and to saints from everywhere. I want to be with you on Saints Day. I greet you today in the name of the Lord. I want to share and worship with you today and just sit and listen and praise. Those of us who do a lot of preaching need to be preached to every now and then. We need to hear the word ourselves every now and then. And so I could have come on last night and could have spoken or perhaps tomorrow or Tuesday. I wanted to come on Saints Day to share in this high spiritual moment. I must say in part I come because of my love and appreciation of the late Bishop Mason. Growing up as a child in Greenville, South Carolina, the first time I ever heard of a man with healing power. And there were people who never saw Bishop Mason who just heard of him and got well. <laughs> just got well from hearing about him. The word went forth. And I remember that time when so many of our churches were European and Presbyterian and frozen on Sunday morning. The Church of God in Christ became the church for common people. We could have a tambourine, a piano, an organ, and some drums. It was authentic black worship and so as I listened to Bishop talk about Madam Moss Clark and the Hawkins and all of that it's no accident it's the providence of God and the missionary work of Bishop Mason and so I'm glad to share with you on this day I say this in my brief greeting this is a spiritual pilgrimage that we are on and we will not be on it very long every day counts I was glad when they said unto me, let us go unto the house of the Lord. And as you see me on television, hear me on radio, and travel around this nation, I'm saved. God has been mighty, mighty, mighty good to me. And each day I walk not in fear, but with strong faith and courage, because I'm walking on the promises of the Lord. The Lord has made many promises to me and he's kept every one of them. I say to you today that God can lift us from the guttermost to the othermost. He can lift us from disgrace to amazing grace. And I say this as I sit down I'm glad to be with saints who know the worth of prayer who are really Christian intellectuals. You know you have to be an intellectual to shout. You have to be profound in your insight to shout. Yes, sir. Only a fool says in his heart, there is no God. Yes, and only a PhD therefore can shout. If you can think 
about the goodness of God and then thank him for his goodness then you shout in other words you think and then you think and then you shout when I think about being born out of wedlock and they almost wiped my mother away and put her out the church I think about God saving my mother and me with no daddy in the house I think and I think and I shout and I stand on these high platforms around the world they call me bastard and illegitimate said I'd never be nothing be just like my daddy they put me down but I think and I think and I shout tears run all down my eyes I serve a mighty God weeping may endure for a night but if you hold on and don't give up joy will come in the morning from the state house to the courthouse to the White House all the way God saves from the other most thank you and God bless you shout on saints shout on saints never doubt them shout on saints Give him a great big God bless you. You may be concerned about what I just told Brother Jesse. Now he's running for the presidency. But don't come here trying to take this away from me because I am the president here. Somebody feel like praising God. May God. Bless.